Some x-rays of gunshot victims are turning into an issue in the Kansas Senate race. The Topeka Capitol Journal reports the State Board of Healing Arts is looking into the actions of Senate candidate Milton Wolf. Commitment 2014 coverage from KNBC 9 political reporter Michael Mahoney. Wolf is a radiologist. Last winter, the Capitol Journal reported that Wolf had a Facebook page with pictures of x-rays of gunshot victims. It's now gone. This is a screen save of Wolf's blog from the same period. Now, the x-ray, somebody who's been shot in the back. My guess, writes Wolf, a jealous husband or jilted lover. He calls it my second favorite gunshot wound of all time. Now, in an interview, Wolf said that doctors have to deal with unique stresses. Is gallows humor? I'll, I'll let you try to define what you think I'll it was. I'll ask you, do you agree with that term, gallows humor? Now, I've, I've never used that term before this campaign came along, and I'm not going to try to analyze it myself or anyone. The newspaper said it learned of the state inquiry when the board asked them for evidence that it used in its reporting. Wolf says the x-rays are from his time as a resident at Truman Medical Center. He says he did not violate any patient privacy. We're talking about anonymous x-rays. And if, uh, if anyone is offended by any of the commentary that came along with it, I apologize at the time. I'll apologize now. His opponent, incumbent three-term Senator Pat Roberts, claims the news makes Wolf a damaged candidate. Roberts, however, is refusing to debate Wolf. In fact, he has postponed an interview with Channel 9 and has yet to reschedule it. Now, there's no word on when the State Board of Healing Arts is going to rule on this. The primary is two weeks from yesterday. Michael Mahoney, KNBC 9 News. Now, Wolf has made a big deal of Roberts not being a full time Kansan. He went to Roberts' Dodge City office today, and that's where Roberts is registered to vote. Wolf says the Roberts office was not open at 10 in the morning. 